at first I didn't know a lot about Canada and that always was my dream to learn a new culture and of course to learn English. My mom told me like, oh you're going to Nova Scotia, I'm like, okay, where is that? <laughs> Nova Scotia has um, fresh air and trees everywhere. It's so positive and everything and everyone is smiling and they are just so friendly to everyone. People actually talk to other people even if they didn't know them. Amazing people, it has amazing attractions, many places to discover, it's just amazing. Before I came to Canada, I never go to the airport by myself. I came to Halifax and it was at night. I was totally tired and I had jet lag and everything and then I saw my host parents and in that moment I was, okay, I'm home. For me, my host family is amazing. They're part of my family and even my family from Mexico and them, when they first met, it was like an instant connection. They're like my family right now. I talk to them about anything. Uh, I'm with one mother and with one homestay brother. He's from Belgium. At school, we are always together. So I think we will be brothers for life, maybe. I hope. <laughs> so grateful to know that I have a family in Mexico and I have a family here in Nova Scotia. The school spirit that you know from all the movies, it's true. It really is. The investors helped me before I came to Nova Scotia because they added me on Snapchat. <laughs> they showed me where the rooms are, where the cafeteria are, where we get our schedules on the first day. The school is really nice, yeah, I really like it. The teachers are really friendly. If you have a problem, you don't be shy to ask a, a question. That's what I like really in Nova Scotia High School because you are really close to the teachers. In Nova Scotia, they're offering students to take what they want and it makes me really happy because I can be in the classes that I'm interested in. When in Turkey, I'm just memorizing everything before the exams and I forget everything. And now I actually learn something here. That's how I feel like. The school definitely offers much more extracurriculars and cool stuff to do than my school in Prague. And I think it's the best place to really make friends. I play soccer for the school. I was in the soccer team with my homestay brother. Like I play in soccer, volleyball, badminton and cross country team. So yeah, I'm pretty busy. Something I never will forget is when I jump the polar dip. It was already cold outside because it was like minus 10 during the, the polar deep jump. <laughs> but it was really good. It was awesome. Right now I feel new, <laughs> a new man. I went to the whale watching. It was really cool and seeing animals like that. You were seeing that on TV, but you didn't see that in your life before, so... It was amazing. In my town, there's ski hill. Hello! At the first time, I couldn't do like ski really well, but now I can do really great, so that's my favorite thing to do. Like seeing first time snowing here in Canada. It was like a miracle for me. I love Canada. It's really wonderful. <laughs> I'm actually afraid of leaving now because I feel like a part of me will stay here because it's been so great. I really recommend it to everybody who can do it. I remember the first day I crying, I was talk to my mom. I said, Mom, I want to go home, I don't want to stay here. But now, like, uh, I don't want to leave Nova Scotia. This is a really nice place, I love here. Welcome to Nova Scotia. Bienvenido to Nova Scotia. Welcome to Nova Scotia. Nova Scotia is a great place. A dream to me, but now it's real.